I'm Matt from eSpares. Now, if your brush roll has stopped spinning on your Bissell vacuum, there's a high chance that the belt has snapped or become loose from the motor spindle. Either way, it's a good idea to replace the belt. And I'm going to show you how to do that today. For this, I'm going to be using the Bissell Power Force bagless, but the process will be very similar for most Bissell vacuums. Now, remembering to unplug the appliance, turn it over. And to access the belt, we need to remove the sole plate by taking off these four screws here. Take the sole plate off, and as you can see, here's the belt wrapped around the brush roll. Now, this one is a little bit loose, so it's a good idea if I change it anyway. Now, I'm just gonna remove the belt from round the motor spindle. I'm gonna use my finger in this instance, but if it is extremely tight, you can use a flathead screwdriver. Take the belt off the motor spindle, release the brush roll, which in turn releases the belt. Here we have a brand new pack of belts. Start by putting the belt around the motor spindle. Feed the brush roll back through the belt. Now, a good little tip is to put one side of the brush roll in place and then feed the other side into position, like so. Give the brush roll a little spin, just to flatten out the belt here, and replace the sole plate. Now, as I'm using an electric screwdriver, I'm using the lowest torque setting, just to not damage the plastic. And there we go, one brand new belt for a Bissell vacuum. Thanks for watching.